your channel you already know it's your girl Tatiana and today I'm gonna be cooking so I'm not an expert in cooking but I told my mom to sit down because I'm gonna take I'm gonna take over today I'm gonna take over I'm gonna do all this cooking today so I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna be making I have this alfredo fettuccine and I'm gonna make this I'm gonna make this um, roasted garlic mashed potato and I don't know if you guys ever had um, the IHOP steak. Well, I'm going to be making that just like they make it at IHOP. And it's going to be so good. And you probably like, what is this? Like, why are you mixing this with this? But just stay and watch. A few moments later. So I already um, like washed it with water. I don't know, something that I always do. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put a little bit of garlic. So, only a little bit. Like, I can say like that. That's it. Second thing you're going to do is you're going to put a little bit of plain salt. That's it. That's it, guys. Like, with this type of thing, you can't put that much. Then we're going to put this seasoning right here. So, mix right in there just like that make sure you guys wash your hands please all right so let me wash my hands and then we're gonna put a little bit of oil like that next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put some sugar so This is some diet sugar, guys. My bad. So that's why it looks like that. You're gonna mix it with the sugar. Because if you ever taste it, IHOP steak is like sweet. It's caramelized. So now you're gonna put the last thing, which is the onions. Put a whole lot. Slice them. I already had a slice. And you're gonna mix it. Mm. I'm gonna mix it all together just like this. Then, now I'm gonna put this in the pan. So, as you can see, I already started putting some. I'm gonna put it over here. Make sure you have the um, heat on high. Put all this right here. I'm gonna separate it like this. Just like this. And since I already put oil, you don't have to put oil in the pan. So you're just gonna put something on top of it, a lid. minutes and then you're gonna start mixing it up okay so now we're gonna do the roasted garlic mashed potatoes so the only thing you have to do with this is just put two cups of water so it's easier if you have something like this so you can like really measure it so you see that's a cup so you put two cups but since i'm doing three right here since i'm doing three of them i put already six cups of water so as you see it's already boiling so I'm about to put this inside. I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it inside right now. So then goes the first one. Then goes the second one. And here goes the third one. So now I'm about to mix it, guys. So I didn't get to blog when I was mixing it, but I did mix it. So for last, I'm gonna put some butter. So I'm gonna use this butter right here and I'm gonna get like this just because you don't have to. But I, oh my god, some butter went through there. My bad, y'all. But now I'm just gonna mix this with the butter. Just because you don't have to, but I always like to put some butter. So that is like so delicious. And it, got, it already come like seasoned. Yeah. You absolutely like to have to put nothing on it. 
Welcome. There it goes. So this is done now. I'm gonna start making this right here. So let's get into it. So for this, the only thing you have to do is put a cup and a half of water and half cup of milk. So I already put the milk in the water in the pan just because you know it was boiling. So I'm about to put it inside the pan. So I already had it on. It's still not boiling like that but as you can see it's hot so i'm just gonna start putting it in there so there goes number one Get back to it. Tell me, guys, how was your how was your day? Like, what do you do today? Comment down below. What do you do today? What are you gonna do tomorrow? And what do you cook, or do you eat some leftovers from yesterday? Like, I didn't eat no leftovers. I don't want to know. I told my mom she was about to um she was gonna eat some leftovers, and I told her no. Listen, I'm coming right back. I'm about to go to Acme real quick, and I'm gonna bring something that I want to eat, and I don't want you to cook because I'm gonna cook today. I'm gonna take over, so you know. I'm making this. Let's see how this is going to turn out. I want you guys to see um, how it's going to turn out. And if you like it, you can do it home. And it's simple. Like, everything, it says it in the back. Like, the recipe, like, how to make it and stuff like that. It says it in the back. So, it's, like, super, super easy. So, yeah. Let me just get into this. See you guys in a little bit. Yeah. I'm getting a plate. I put it in a plastic plate because your girl is not gonna be washing dishes. So this is how it looks. Super good, guys. It's an easy meal, fast, and yeah, I'm about to enjoy this. Mommy, how it tastes? It's so good, good, good. Ronnie, how it tastes? Delicious. Good. How is it? It's goody. Yummy. Um. So guys, we ate and we're like super full. Are you full, Ronnie? He's like he can't even talk. Mommy, are you full? Yeah, yeah, I'm full, 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 full. <laughs> it was so good. So you guys could try it home and it's easy and it's an easy meal and stuff like that. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna cut this video here. Make sure to like, subscribe, turn your post notifications on, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, the mix. I mean, see you.